What's up guys, Gold Dipper125 for the first time in two years back for a uh, new video. Um, a couple quick things. A, this is going to be like one of my very few last videos. I'm just not, I, I pretty much have really cut back on collecting and I've become more of a private collector. So, you know, don't really expect many more belts that I'm going to be collecting for myself. Um, I'm also venturing off into other projects, which I will explain it during the video. And this is actually part of it. But, uh, yeah. So, this is actually a belt I've worked, I did a place myself. You know what? I'm just going to get right into it. What I have here is a a fully restoned uh, WWE I mean, version one spinner. Uh, this has been. Uh, I actually just got this back. It's been re-leathered by uh, uh, somebody on BellTalk.com. Sorry, I just got a. T I'm filming on my iPhone, so the quality is not gonna be the best, and I keep getting messages. But yeah, this was uh, actually re-leathered by somebody on BellTalk.com, and I'm doing. Actually, restoring his spinner plates for him, and he said, "Hey, do that. I'll give you two free leather jobs." Okay, I'm not gonna bitch about that. So this isn't going to be much of a review. This is more just showing off the work I did on the stones. But uh, like I said, the person who uh, re leathered this was Belt fans of the greats. Like I said, from Belt Talk, uh, Silver Tip. He did really, really nice texturing. In the snap box, and I will say this, you know, well, the leather for this being on real leather, it's pretty stiff. It's actually kind of stiff, but it actually reminds me so much of a of a real J Mar belt. And for anybody who's seen my older videos, knows that I have had many uh, J Mar belts in the past. I mean, it's still it's still pretty flexible, but it reminds me so much of a J Mar kind of leather that. I'm actually really happy with it. I, I really don't care about being flexible. I wanted it to be as close to J. Mars Bell as possible, and... Damn, dude, you fucking nailed it. <laughs> if you're watching this. Anyways, so yeah. J. Mar, uh shell tooling. You know, 2x5 snap, female snap, silver tip. Into the stonework. Every, I replaced all the stones. All the little square ones in here. Uh, for these, though, I used. I didn't use the square ones. I actually used round, uh, round stones. Just because I really didn't. I, you know, with this being my first ever restoning, I really didn't want to sit there and risk. You know, drilling all the different holes for the square. So, kind of copped out a little bit. So. The effect is still the same. And obviously, I painted it silver. It's like it was on TV. Even though I kind of wish I went with the leaf silver on this one. Over here to the Monday Night Raw plate. And these are Savorsky crystals, not... Not... The other stones, which I really don't know how to pronounce, and I'm not going to try to, or else I'm going to sound like even more of an idiot. I, I'm missing a stone there, which I am going to replace. Over here to the main plate. And if you're asking, and if you're wondering why this in the background behind the WWE logo is like completely different from over here, I didn't do any pol. I'm just gonna say this: I didn't do any polishing. I didn't do the never dull trick. What happened was when I bought the spinner off eBay, um, I don't know if somebody tried using paint stripper. I don't know what the fuck happened, but it was t like this up here and behind here was all freaking tarnished. So I just, I just repainted it all. Well, with a gold leaf uh, paint pen. Kind of did a quick touch up. I might have to touch it up in some space spots. And yes, I got a piece of cardboard down there to stop the spinner for right now. Because my spinner screw broke. Yay. But again. 
all everything was restoned, including the squares. I'm probably going to end up uh, talking to Bell Diction from Bell Talk to get a Triple H, an Edge, and a Jeff Hardy nameplate made up. And a Brady Orton, since those were the four people that held uh, this belt in 2008, which is next to the Edge, is probably the only two versions of the spinners I actually really like. The WWE side plate. And I kind of just painted this just to match the main play because I figured why the hell not. And mail snap boxes. Oh, mail snaps. Over. Nice move back, and as you can tell, I actually had to cut the hole out because, like I said, my spinner screw fucking snapped on me. And if quick little tutorial, if this ever happens to you guys, like if you have a like if the spinner screw or if the non-spinner screw breaks, all you gotta do is take the back part out. And get some nose, uh, hang on. I think the uh, nose pliers or something, and just take a hold of the actual threaded screw itself and just twist it out. It's the easiest way to do it if that ever happens to you. I'm going to get a new one because I really don't want this belt to be spinning and I don't want to keep having to use cardboard. But yeah, beautiful, beautiful leather. Uh, belt fan Dan. Um, yeah, Bell Fan of the Greats did a phenomenal job on this. Like, it, it feels just like an actual JMR belt. I mean, his the thickness of the leather is, like, spot on. At least in my opinion. I know people are going to debate that. Now it's flexible, which is fine with me, because this is just going to go up on display. Anyways, um... So, the reason why I said I'm venturing out to other projects is because I am actually going to be start. I want to start doing restoning for people, which is why my first restoning was the spinner belt. Um, I am not opening up services right away. I mean, I am actually working on two other spinners. I'm working on another version one, and I'm also working on a, a rated R's belt which is nearly completed in fact my buddy once I finish that tonight my buddy's gonna be bringing it to Wrestlemania this Sunday when him and I go so if anybody else is going keep an eye keep your eyes open for us uh, I'll be bringing most likely be bringing this spinner but yeah and that does it uh, keep your ears open for if you want a belt restoned um, and just expect more work from me